After verifying your address on Google AdSense, your next step will be to add your payment method so you can receive your payment when it's due. Now in this video, I will be showing you step by step how to add your payment method on Google AdSense. Let's go. Hello and welcome. My name is Tokwe Awomashe and on this channel, I share information and insights to help you scale your business using YouTube. Now, if you're new here and you want more content like this, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell below for notifications. Now to the topic of today, I'll be taking you straight to my AdSense account to show you how to link your payment method, shall we? All right, in your Google AdSense account, if you're yet to complete this step, you're gonna be seeing something like this on your homepage saying, your payments are currently on hold, action is required to release payment. Now you can start by hitting the button here that says action or go straight to your payment tab here, go to the payments info page and start from there. So here on this page, you will see this red bar here, click on the button that says update and click on add payment method. Now here you have two options. First is to add new wire transfer details. This means that your payment is wired directly into your bank account by Google AdSense. And the next option here is to add new check details where you would type in your mailing address to receive a physical check. Now, if you prefer to receive your payment by a physical check written for you, then you want to click on this second option. Now, let's quickly take a look at this and see how it works. So select add new check details and it's gonna open up this page where you have a form to fill. Now the instruction here says, enter the address that you would like the check to be delivered to. Now be very sure that this address works, that it's valid, you know, and uh, then if all that is okay by you, feel free to go ahead with the form and this can be independent of your billing address really. And if you want this to be your primary payment method, check this box, but read this instruction below before you click on save. And it reads this payment method may need to be verified. And if you make this your primary payment method, payments may be delayed. So if you are comfortable with this, feel free to go ahead check the box and click on save. Now, personally, I prefer a wire transfer, especially also because um, the postal service here in my side of the world is not absolutely seamless. And so I want to play safe. If you're very confident in the effectiveness of your postal service in your country, feel free to use the check payment method if that's your preference. So let's go back to the wire transfer option and it will open up the form for you to fill in your bank details. Now read the instruction here, which says to receive payouts by bank transfer, contact your bank for exchange rates and fees and all of that. It will not on, it will not be on your Google AdSense. Okay. And then also note that bank account must be located in my case, it must be located in Nigeria where I live and it must be in US dollar currency. So I will be linking my domiciliary account, not my Naira account. So I have a dollar account basically, and that's what I will be linking here. Okay. So if you are watching me from Nigeria, you don't have a dollar account. I advise you open one and link that account to your AdSense instead of a Naira account, okay? So let's proceed with filling the form. Now the beneficiary ID is optional and I'm gonna skip it because I don't know what it means. So I'll start by filling in the name on my bank account. All right, so fill in the name on your bank account. I believe that's your full name. Then your bank name, in my case, it's Guarantee Trust Bank. Now next, we are typing in the Swift BIC. Now, what does this mean? You want to hit on the icon here to read about it if you're not sure what it means. And here it says it's often called BIC and is an eight or 11 character identification code 
for a particular bank okay and so if you check on google uh swift bic your bank you are very likely to see it straight up on the internet but to play safe i have a link in the description area below that you can just click on and uh, on the page on the web page there search for the one for your bank so i'm going to be using the link myself now and uh, you can use the link also when you are ready so let's go so here is the page and there are two things you can do here one is to check a swift code be sure it's linked to your bank all right the other is to find a swift code so here i'm going to start by typing in my country because i want to find my swift code select my bank which is guarantee trust bank plc select my city which is lagos and hit the blue button that says find swift code all right now here if you scroll up you would see that you have two options okay the first one says use this code for any guaranteed trust bank in nigeria any guaranteed trust bank branch in nigeria that's what i'm going to use all right here we have it it is gtbingla now forget about the triple x the triple x would have been real characters if you were going for the swift code for your branch again we're using the swift code that works for any branch in nigeria so when you copy this you're going to delete the three x's at the end of the code okay so copy this and paste in your adsense account I believe you should be able to use the code exactly like this with the triple X, but I'm not used to seeing the triple X's. Okay. Oh, every time I've used this code, I've used it without the triple X. So I deleted the three X's. All right. And I've been paid twice. Like I said, so delete the triple X. If you are bold enough, if you're not leave it like that and then fill in your account number twice just to be sure you're typing in the correct account number okay it's time to move up i'll set this as my primary payment method and save and that's it all right now that you're done your next step is to keep your fingers crossed and wait for your first paycheck now by the way i made a video about my first youtube paycheck how much i earned and i also shared some important information about the payment process so if you would like to learn about all of that you would find the video up here or in the description area below thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next video and until then keep showing up and keep crushing it bye